talked about this defense before, but I just have to tell you again that this is the best blitzing defense in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I upload new videos every single day that can help you become a better Madden player. And today we are talking about the nickel triple. Now, the nickel triple, like I said, is the best blitzing defense in the game. There are so many things that we can do with this defense. You can get A-gap pressure, defensive tackle, nano blitzes. You can get two-man edge pressure off of either edge. Um, this this con this defense is truly, um, like if I was going to run a blitzing-based defense, this is the defense that I would run. I love this defense. Um, and, and we're going to talk about a blitzing concept that you can use out of the cover three today uh, to get very simple pressure. And the setups are really simple. There's really not a lot that you have to do uh, to get this defense set up, which is why I like it so much. Um, but again, if you want to learn my entire nickel triple defense, I released it earlier this year uh, in my Patreon membership. This defense, I'm telling you right now. Better pressure than dollar three two six. Better pressure than two four five odd. Better pressure than three three five wide. It has the best pressure of any defense in the game. It's got phenomenal run defense. It's got a front that is really scary. We're going to show you that in just a second. So check out that nickel triple if you want to get it. There's a link to join my Patreon. As soon as you join the Patreon, you're going to get instant access to every ebook that I've released so far in the Madden 22 season. Uh, as it sits right now, we have 13 offensive and defensive guides available, and I've got several more that are going to be coming out over the coming weeks. So uh, make sure you sign up for that Patreon. There's a link in the description below to do that. But in this video, like I said, we're talking about a five-man blitz. It's very simple. Um, you can really do it out of the cover one, but I like to do this out of the cover three uh, LB or the cover three sky. And what you're going to see here, all we're going to do is we're going to show blitz. We're going to blitz the safety off the left edge. We're going to QB contain. And then I like to user this safety. So um, I'm going to user the safety because I think that it, it, it just gives the illusion. There's a lot of pressure that can come from this front right here. So we can then, you know, kind of just do some basic adjustments off of it. So it looks something like this. And it's a simple five-man blitz. And what you're going to notice here is if you want to blitz your user, you certainly can do that. Uh, kind of stand like right over the A-gap. And what you're going to see right here is we're going to get pressure off of this left edge super clean at the quarterback. Now, I talk, I've talked about this in previous videos and breakdowns I've done on this. One of my favorite things to do, specifically against the gun bunch, is to man up the running back. The reason why I like to do this is because then from that point, I can feel free to just simply man across or um, drop off all the coverage on this backside here. And then, you know, kind of basically do a little bit of a, I don't know, like a roll coverage to that side. All I got to watch out for are crossers. And the reason I like to do this is let's say they block the running back. Oftentimes, if you man up that running back this blitz will still come in let me show you that one more time it is certainly more effective if you utilize the five-man version uh, it's just a little bit more consistent but let's say for example that you know you wanted to try to get this to come in even if they block the running back even if they max protect even this for the most part will still come in uh, off that left edge i'm getting a little bit of a bad animation uh, in this example here but um, what you can do is if you man this guy up you don't actually have to contain um, because you're going to get this little slip blitz angle that is really effective. So something like this, the contain is just to help um, with a blocked running back. But you see, if I man this guy up, you see, look how clean that pressure can come at the quarterback. Now, uh, I want to spend just a quick second on something else real quick. If they block, let's say, for example, that your opponent uh, decides that they want to go ahead and uh, block their tight end, what you're going to see is because of the type of pressure that this is, it's kind of a... It, it's not 100% against a block tight end, but it's it's actually really fairly um, consistent against a block tight end. So uh, let me show you that one more time. So again, we're just going to set this play up. This time I'm going to QB contain. If you watch this block tight end, you see you get this uh, B gap little disengage pressure that is going to come pretty clean at the quarterback. So um, this is one of the many reasons why I really love this defense. There's a there's so much that uh, I could talk about in this video, but I'm just telling you right now, if you want to learn this entire nickel triple defense, please check it out uh, in the description. There's a link to my Patreon membership where you'll be able to get access to all of my eBooks um, that I've released over the course of the Mountain 22 season. Again, the setup is really simple. Show blitz, blitz that guy. If you want to bring this guy down, and then you could, if you want to just use or this Col uh, Collins right here, you certainly can do that. I really advise to go ahead and man up that uh, running back 
and as you can see right there that time we got a little bit of weird animations um, if you want a little bit more consistency uh, what you want to do with this guy right here is just kind of move him just a little bit like move him just like that just a little bit and then you know you're gonna see right here then it's gonna really isolate and you're, as you can see you get super fast pressure so you could run this as a five-man pressure but you could also run this as a as a um, Whoops, uh, you could also run this as a three-man. You could run this as a, a even a two-man pressure. Uh, again, just move this guy in just a just like a step or two, uh, just so you can get this animation. And then as I said, you know, you see here, you get this animation right there where he just loops around. This is my favorite blitzing defense in the game by far. So if you are someone that likes to send a lot of pressure, there's also some really cool coverages that you can do out of the nickel triple that most people don't really utilize. But if you want to learn everything about this defense, join the patreon there's a link in the description below where you can join that by joining that you get access to everything you don't just get access to nickel triple but you get access to 245 odd 335 odd 46 dollar uh, 326 and everything else we've got 13 ebooks in that membership for you right now so thanks for watching this video if you want to take your madden game to the next level join the patreon there is a link in the description below so head on down click that link and check out that patreon membership